these days. Uh, playing some more Slay the Spire. Uh, last week I tried to do Ascension 20 with Silent. I could have pulled it off on stream, but of course the moment I wasn't streaming and tried to play later on, I did get through it. But rather than going through that grueling process again, I think I'm just going to show you my progress with the Ironclad so far. Just working on getting him up those ascensions. You know, maybe maybe once I get Ironclad up to Ascension 20, I'll come back and revisit the Silent once, once I've had a bit of a break. Given then I'll be rusty and it'll be even harder, but eh, that's alright. So, let's just hop right into it with a Ascension 8 Ironclad and see how this goes. <clears throat> Okay, Ooh, some tough choices here already, uh, but relics can make and break a game. Removing a card is nice, but not absolutely necessary. Eh, one while. Well, sustain is not bad. It's better to not take damage, but sustain is not bad. I'm not going to be bothering with the heart while I'm just climbing the ascension. So, let's see. I'm going to fight an elite. I want it to be an Act 1. But, this is a pretty nice path right here. Although, I do want to make sure I get a shop. Is there a way I can get two shops? Uh, no, there's no way I can get two shops. So, this path is just, that is way too many elites. I come up this one. Okay, I can turn left here and take on this elite if I'm feeling confident, and that'll get me a few extra campfires. Yeah, all right, we'll, we'll, we'll do that. <clears throat> all right. So let's. Curl that one and block as much as we can here. Uh, we do have eight heal, so we're in pretty good shape there, regardless. Although well, we don't want to take any more damage now. All right, so we'll take less by killing that and blocking. Yeah, take a little more than we wanted, but that's okay. We're still coming out largely unscathed after the heal. We didn't get to top off quite like we were hoping for, but that's all right. Oops, should have bashed first, but oh well. Don't think it would have made a difference this turn. Well, it might have if I only drew one strike this turn. Alright, but we're good. Uh, don't really like any of this. Yeah, nope. Uh, I wish I could skip this event. I hate gambling with it, but there's no choice to turn it down. <laughs> yeah, well, we heal our six hit points. <laughs> hey, at least we didn't get cursed. Alright. <laughs> don't really want to spend money on the cleave, but... We really do. Getting a getting an AOE attack really early on can make a really big difference. Um, so looks like we're probably going to have to take a cleave. Yeah, we'll take the cleave just to make sure we don't screw ourselves over here. All right, well, we'll call that good. Just got to be as aggressive as possible here, because, again, we're going to heal 8, and this guy scales really fast. Killing him quick is most important. Taking that 6 damage is meaningless, although, yeah, we should be able to kill him this turn. All right, good stuff. Got out of that unscathed. 
Uh, of course we got offered a cleave two seconds later. Uh, that's a shame. Alright, well, I mean, we, we only need the one. Well, more cleaves isn't bad. I just, I'm not going to upgrade both of them. Yeah, we'll take the war cry, because you can almost never go wrong with war cries. Uh, Alright, now we'll... Hmm. You know, I'm just not a big fan of Ash. A lot of people like it, but I, I just don't like it. It's just too expensive, and, you know, I'd, I'd much rather be spending most of my time double blocking and then one attack. Because, you know, that's that's just how what you need to do for most runs. So, although it's probably too soon to take out the bash because you sort of need it till you get a little bit more secure in your offense or defense, it, it helps you out in the early game. So maybe I'll keep it for now, uh, <clears throat> especially if we're going to try to fight this elite right here. So we'll just drop one of our basic strikes, and Bash is probably next to go. Oh yeah, I hope we'll just upgrade this cleave. <coughs> and then we need to decide here whether we're going to take on that elite or not. Cleave. Uh, all right, and we'll likely be able to get out of this unscathed. Well, counting our heal, anyways. All right, perfect. Lethal there. Uh, ooh, ah, this is this is tough. Like, entrench can just completely win the game for you, but if you don't manage to get, like, a full defense build going, it's garbage. Whereas Evolve, Evolve is... I didn't used to think it was good, but I I, I took it at one point just because my other options were terrible, and I knew I was about to come up against a person that was going to inflict a bunch of statuses on me, and Evolve is actually really dang good. So I'm going to take the Evolve much as I want the entrench, I just don't know if it's going to end up being worth it. And right now, particularly, it's just going to be a dead card. And especially if we're going to try and take on this elite here. Yeah, I think we can take an elite. I mean, between the cleave and the bash, we should be all right. It's going to hurt a bit, but that's okay. We've got a lot of sustain. Uh, of course. Uh, well, so what I want to do is thin my deck down as much as possible here. <coughs> so basically, I want to play this of all before I start the fight, since he's going to sit here and sleep for three turns. We sort of want to get this evolve out of the way and then try to set up a perfect bash cleave turn. to wake him up with. There's no reason not to play the bash, since that won't wake him up, but it will apply the vulnerable, and if next turn I just, if I draw, you know, since I'm getting the cleave next turn, if I draw a third strike, we'll go ahead and just wake him up with it. <coughs> Alright, yeah, we're going to Wake him up. Ooh, chunked him pretty good there, thanks to that little combo. Yeah, and we really just sort of need to go full offense and accept that we're going to take some damage. So if we try to stall, he's going to start debuffing us, and it's just going to go downhill real quick. So, we're going to take a lot of damage early on here, but that's okay, you know, especially while we have this vulnerable going, need to take advantage of it. <coughs> I 
okay, looks like, you know, we'll, we'll get out of, you know, we'll, we'll beat a Laga with only taking... Well, we might end up getting... Uh, yeah, we drew bad. Yeah, if I'd drawn a third strike, we would have... Had a home run here. Let's see, next turn. Okay, next turn we're guaranteed to draw enough for... Are we, though? Because... Let's see. We're going to lose some damage on that cleave. Hold on. Alright, our... 10, 15... Okay, yeah, we'll have guaranteed lethal next turn. So we just need to full block as much as we can. It's a real shame. I was really hoping to get out of this without taking any more damage. <clears throat> but, oh well. Wait a second. Yeah, no, no. It was just not happening. Alright, there we go. Well, it took eight more damage than we were hoping for, but that's alright. Oh. Man, it's not terrible. Playing three attacks doesn't happen too often. Ugh. Well, armaments... Well... Feed's not great, but uh, feed, feed exhausts itself too. Eh. Maybe we'll throw the feed in just, you know, it's super early game, so we can get a lot of value out of feed. What is it upgrading? Yeah, we'll we'll take it. Well, I would have liked the war cry to be upgraded, but eh. okay. So there's really not much point in in upgrading evolve because then your hand just tends to fill up. And if we're going in for the feed here, and if we're, if we're playing the feed, we may as well sort of commit to it sort of a choice between the feed and the war cry, but let's let's try to get as much value out of this feed as we can since we actually took it. <clears throat> oh, dang. That may champion belt means we're pretty much gonna have to keep our bash. That's alright. Well, you know, well I don't like bash it's not a bad card, and now we have a reason to keep it, so that's all right. In fact, I may just go ahead and upgrade it right now, just to... Yeah, we'll go ahead and just upgrade that bash. Warcry keeps getting neglected, but that's all right. <coughs> all right. Fingers crossed that we'll get to use our feed. Ooh. Hmm. Top call. Let's see. We don't really need to use the campsite to upgrade anything. Like, upgrading the war cry would be nice, but it is far from necessary. Who, do, who are we up against? Okay, so we're up against that dude. And yeah, we don't need to. Use, we don't need to upgrade, so we'll rest there. We'll take advantage of this review of a card now. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> yeah, we really don't need that many strikes. And again, we don't want to stall out. Oh, we have the evolved, so we can afford to stall out here. Drew up the strike. Alright, come on, feed value. Ooh. Well, I might end up safe scumming this fight, but we'll see what happens here. Just save 
save that for next turn. Okay, we should be able to get our feed off without too much problem. I think, unless my math is bad, which is a strong possibility. Alright, so start with the, feet, the cleave, and then we get the feed. Yeah, good stuff. Alright, we got the feed off. We took no damage in the fight. That went pretty well. Ooh, body slams. Body slam tends to be like a my favorite win condition, given we are so far not building a very defensive deck, but that's alright. I still think it's just too good to pass up. Yeah, now I like my body slams. Now I may go ahead and upgrade that body slam, though. I don't know, we really don't have enough defense. That's a that's another tough call here. We really ought to just rest, but you know what? I feel like taking a risk, especially because we have the ornamental fan. Forgot about the ornamental fan. Perhaps I shouldn't have removed my strike there, but ornamental fan with a zero cost body slam. It's gonna be a pretty good deal. Yeah, alright. We'll upgrade the body slam and hopefully not have horrible regrets for not healing. Oh! I thought I thought it was the the floating prism dude that shot stuff at you. Picture deceived me. Well, this fight of all is useless, but that's all right. All right, well, war cry. Yeah. I actually want the evolve back, but I want to play all of this this turn. I'm kidding. able to break them out of this mode without too much issue. It's just, a, do we want to try and win with the feed? Yeah, well, our deck is small enough that we can pretty reliably find the feed when we need it. Ending. Uh, oh, we can even throw a cleave in. Good stuff. That was a perfect turn. It's a shame to be wasting the vulnerable, but. Ooh. Well, I'm going to get my bash again next turn. So it's not like we're wasting that much vulnerability. Uh, we'll just we'll just take some damage here. Yeah, let's let's use that vulnerable as much as we can. Oh yeah, we hit we we get the fan. I keep forgetting about my fan. So that was. That felt good. That felt worth it. <coughs> that will hopefully pay off in the long run here. Alright, so... Uh, guess we're just gonna... Ooh, that is gonna hurt a lot, but... We're sort of committed now. don't want to break them out. Yeah, I think I would rather get another turn before he transforms here. So I'm just gonna hang tight and 
hopefully we'll draw oh okay there's body slams in the pile so pretty much no matter what we draw we're guaranteed to break them out of that <laughs> another bash not bad uh, although I do need to do this correctly here oh, no. oh dang messed up should have striked first Oh well, I guess what's done is done. Yeah, I lost a little bit of damage there. I don't think the obviously slam was going to chew through it. <coughs> Shame vulnerable doesn't apply to stuff like fire potions. And well, maybe the bash is worth it just just for the week. Yeah, well, let's, let's go for the bash. I don't think the body slam is worth it because if we were getting the pan off, then possibly, but. Not now. Well, hopefully we can not die. Or we won't die this turn, but go for the strike. Let's see what's coming next. Yeah, let's well, just full offense at this point. We'll hopefully be able to finish him with a fire potion. Unless I am extra bad at math here, which is a reoccurring problem, isn't it? Hopefully I don't need to save scum. Not a bad body slam. Not bad at all. Hmm, I may not even need the fire potion. I may throw it, but we'll wait a turn. No need to rush into it. Oh yeah, oh, we're gonna... Oh no! Definitely want to finish with the beat. Ah, but... We have body slam. Body slam... Wait, I need to not kill him. Okay, the body slam won't kill him. Oh no, the body slam will kill him. But, oh no, the feet will kill him because he's vulnerable. Alright, we're good. Perfect. Didn't even need to use the fire potion. Definitely pretty low on health, but that's alright. Demon form. We're impervious. Tough call. Both are really good. Demon form is a pretty big win condition, but since we do have the body slam, going for the impervious is pretty appealing as well. Demon form is a pain in the butt to use, but it's too good to pass up. Hmm. Uh, Choker is pretty good for. Ironclad. It's terrible for Silent, but it's pretty good for Ironclad. Pandora's box isn't worth it because it's too much of a risk, and since we have our upgraded defense, we really don't want to do that. So, Choker is exceptional. What do you want, Cat? Choker is very good for Ironclad. What? Hi. Alright. Pick up an early shop, that's solid. Uh, uh, uh. Ooh, we get lots of shops this run. Now at this point we really do just want to avoid elites as much as we can. So, yeah, uh, may not be a way, wait, okay, so if I come up, okay, I can fight no elites and pick up two shops. Alright, yep, there we go. There's our path. No elites, two shops.
or when we play the Evolve, just so it gets out of our hand and we don't keep drawing it. Uh, I do want to try and use the feed properly, so I'll hold off on it. Demon form. Yeah, let's just demon form it. Take a little bit of damage, but that's okay, because we've got sustain. Demon form will pay off in the long run here. Meow, meow, meow. Again, beat up more than we want it, but we'll live. <clears throat> well, unfortunately, his artifact makes Bash pretty unappealing, but my other option is to use the feed, and I don't want to do that. Fingers crossed we'll at least be able to finish the fight with feed. Man, we're getting beat up though. Speed. Okay, feed is back in there, so there's a good chance we will be able to finish the fight with feed next turn. Definitely got beat up a lot for it being just uh alright, nope. Oh. Another feed win. Okay, don't need another. Uh, Shame champion belt doesn't work in both directions. Uh, then I'd take the intimidate, but. Uh, Alright, yeah, we did keep our bash. So, yeah, we'll go for the dropkick. It's. Well, then again, we do need to be careful about our choker here. So let's see. We play play four cards off of our mana. A fifth would be Body Slam. A sixth would be War Cry. But we're never going to... Can't play War Cry twice. So yeah, we can afford a drop kick without overdoing our choker. I should go for the demon form nice and early here. Yeah, we'll go for it. So we'll demon form. Uh, War cry. Do we? Yeah, we'll, we'll really just want to get three. Nah, we, we don't want to be. Well, we can, we can bash. And do have the, the mana for it, but mm. maybe I should have just put the strike there. Oh well. well if we dip into our potions, we could clear this fight no problem. But I like to avoid that if I can. Alright, so okay, now we're going to cleave. Uh, well, if I was going to go for the bash, I should have done it a moment ago, but oh well. Oh, taking a bit more than we wanted. Maybe I should just 
blow the potions here. Let's see, yeah, we're not gonna fight any elites. Let's just win this fight without taking any casualties here. Feels a bit wasteful, but I might end up regretting it, but what's done? I guess it's not too late to save scum, but hey, wait. Mm. No, flight, I need to do another attack first. Uh, this is going to do five. Right, now we'll get the feed win. There we go. Good stuff. Ooh, flame barrier being upgraded is pretty appealing. Yeah, I think we'll go for the upgraded flame barrier. Like we we have the choker, so we can afford to be using these two mana cards. Deck's getting a bit bigger than we wanted it for trying to use speed and whatnot. All right, I'm gonna cheat with the tome. I'm gonna find out what it is before committing. You can just go ahead and save scum. Oh boy. Hmm. But the only attack we have. Oh, but double bashing is pretty nice. Yeah, we can borrow. We, we have a lot of sustain. Ah, uh, except I don't want the curse. I don't want the curse. We don't have enough two attack, two cost attacks to make the Necronomicon worth it. I, I guess I could try to build into it, but I'm just, I don't feel like it. I'd rather just keep my health and stay uncursed. Hi, little kitty. All right. Okay, well, we're definitely removing a card here. Let's see. I think we almost certainly want to just drop strikes at this point. Because we, we've got... We have the offense that we need since... Now we're actually just using bash. Bash, cleave, body slam, drop kick. It's really all the attacks we need. Be nice, kitties. Uh, nothing else here is real appealing. Maybe if Pummel was upgraded, but nah. Yep, we'll just save our gold. Let's see, we are getting another shop this run. Yeah, we're getting another shop this run, so we're just going to save the gold. Wait, did I just... Wait, no. Picked the only path. Couldn't mess it up, because there was only one path. Alright. Uh, usually you want to try to kill the mystic first, but... I guess we're going to try it the other way around and see how that goes. <clears throat> May as well drop kick first, no reason not to. Cleave, no reason not to. kill him this turn, but we will likely be able to next turn. Well, he is going to heal him like a jerk. He can at least keep us from drawing the Evolve. Then we maxed out our Choker. That's okay. No, we, we can't really afford to add more than maybe one more zero-cost card to the deck. Let's see, because we get four 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 off of mana, one off of body slam, one off of drop kick, 
Yeah, we can afford one or two more zero costs. Unfortunately, I don't know if I'm going to actually be able to kill him. I really do want to hold off on the feed and use it right. <coughs> Although, uh -oh. okay, so flame barrier mostly just for the body slam. Uh, uh maybe. Oh, yeah. All right, we did kill it. <coughs> A little unorthodox going for the knight first, but hey. Whatever works. Bash drop kick, good deal. Uh, well, let's just take no extra damage at this point. <coughs> <coughs> Easy fight, no reason to take damage. Cleave. Almost there. Well, that went pretty well. That fight did, anyways. Meow. Kitties. Don't want any of that. What did we have? Okay, demon forms probably worth upgrading. What did we get? Or okay, drop doesn't upgrade very well. But demon form, demon form is worth it. Hmm. Well, we can save scum this. So we, we can see if there's something we really want. If there isn't, we can save scum and take the heal. I would certainly like a true grit. True grit's really nice to have. But we have the evolve, so the true grit's not nearly as necessary. Now mainly I was checking this for a big win condition, like um, uh, not demon form, but the the armor power that makes your armor permanent or something like that. If there was an upgraded True Grid, I'd take it. But as there is not an upgraded one, I think we're just going to save Scum out and take the heal. And we've definitely been getting lots of value out of that feed. <clears throat> That's a pretty well-timed heal there. In fact, I may even take on this elite. Oh, this elite. Yeah, I may go ahead and take on. What are the Act 2 elites? Is there any Act 2 elites that I'm really scared of? Get a demon form off. Uh, Alright, we get more damage off. Body slam. <coughs> Let's see, what, what's our, what's our boss? Uh, hmm. Warcry, there's no reason not to. Uh, throw the feed on top. Oh, wait a second. No, I could have killed that. Oh no, I'm safe skimming. I messed that one up. I could just, I can kill that with feed and bash this turn. So let's, let's try that one more time here. All right, human form and body slam. All right, cool. we'll just be able to kill that. Killing that's a way better deal. And more cry. Oh, don't need the crappy defend. Oh wait, maybe I did. No, we can take three points of damage. We'll heal that up, no problem. Alright. 
So let's go ahead and Did I mess that up? Well, whatever. We're we're fine. We're gonna heal all of that as long as that's the last damage we take. Uh, I don't think we have any... Oh, we do have a couple days. So maybe playing the ball will be worth it, but oh, well, we know we're going to Flame Barrier. Uh, we're not going to defend. Oh, I'll just cleave. Oh, there is only two days in the deck. And days so all right, well, we'll play the ball fine. And can we just kill him thanks to yeah we can just kill him good stuff kitties hey well we found ourselves a true grit uh, yeah we'll, we'll take the true grit it's terrible until it's upgraded but we'll get to upgrade before we even do a fight Clay is not terrible. Again, you usually want to not be taking damage. Alright, yep. Uh, upgrading that true grit for sure, because it goes from useless to amazing. <laughs> Alright, so do I want to take on this elite? I'm feeling pretty good. Like, we've got. Pretty strong deck. Yeah, we're. Well, let me double check the Act 2 Elites before I commit. <clears throat> Is there anyone in Act 2 we're really scared of? Okay, so we can definitely deal with the Stabber. Yeah, no, I think we can handle the Act 2 Elites here. Alright, yeah, we're gonna. Let's go for this one since we get a chance to be a tiny bit more prepared. Oh god. Well that's That's unfortunate. I did not want to have to fight these guys and an elite, but I ain't giving up all my gold. All right. Leave. But, you know, we, we've got a pretty strong deck right now. Oh, perfect time for feed. Uh, and bash. Oh, that's, that's pretty well. Take a little bit of damage here. Not too bad. Well, that's a little bit unfortunate. <laughs> okay, well, drop kick. It's not. It's not much, but better than nothing, I guess. I'm really gonna. Okay, no, we'll, we'll get to draw another card. <sighs> Dang it. I can't believe he's gonna live. Maybe we'll use our block potion. Yeah, we'll just use the block potion. Uh, 
<clears throat> uh, at least it's dead now. Uh, true grit away the bad defend. Well, it could have gone a little bit better than it did, but wasn't too bad either. Yeah, could have gone a lot better, but oh well. <clears throat> it's going to be a tough elite followed by the boss, but we're pretty well prepared. No reason not to drop kick first. I already fed properly, yeah. Okay. Alright. Uh, the red mask is nice though. Ooh, whirlwind. Tempting. But it's not upgraded. We already have a cleave. An upgraded cleave. <coughs> Yeah, we already have an upgraded cleave. We don't need a whirlwind. We have better things to do with our mana. <clears throat> okay, well, we're almost always going to play an attack. Lantern's not terrible. Lantern's pretty good because it'll let us you know play a demon form without being punished too badly and I can afford a lantern and a card removal. don't want any of their trip is pretty tempting because of our champion belt though we'll go for that and we know we're gonna remove a card I really want to get rid of another strike. Yeah, I think I do. We really, we don't. We really don't want to be playing strikes. We really want to be playing body slams and/or better things than strikes. So, strikes, strike can go. But now we have to decide between trip and lantern. All right, what? Where are we at, choker wise? So. So, four cards. Uh, we're not going to count the War Cry because it exhausts itself. It can just be played at a point where it won't interfere with Joker. So, four, five, six. But considering a lot of the time we're going to be playing a two mana card, we can definitely afford another zero. Okay. Our deck is a little bit too big to reliably lantern form. Uh, use lantern with demon form. And I think because of the champion belt, the trip's going to be too good to pass up. Because we don't have any other ways to apply weak, and trip is just solid. Don't want any any of the rest of this though. <clears throat> oh, well, let's okay, we go for the. Uh, I can't demon form and flame barrier, so we'll just flame barrier. Uh, evolvable that. No reason not to play the evolve, which will actually make his debuff completely pointless. So we're 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 in good shape.
Okay, so we can war cry. Uh, oh, top. No reason not to drop kick. Leave. Hmm. Shame that I'm not going to be able to bash him, but that's okay. And I think I'm actually going to. Do I want a true grit that defend? It is one of my good defends. No, we won't. Especially because our evolve makes his debuff meaningless. <coughs> And leave body slam. Mm, shame to not use the feed properly, but oh well. Taking a little bit of damage, but we'll heal most of that. Days do not concern us. Uh, we can't play the flame barrier and the demon form. But can we full block with demon form? Eight. Yeah, we can just full block with demon form and play demon form. Hopefully, this fight will go on long enough to have the demon form pay off. Bash, just for the weak more than anything. All right, no reason not to drop kick. <coughs> That's true grit. The bad defend. Maybe I should have gone for the strike in a block potion. Don't want to use the block potion though, because I don't want to waste any of it. We can just go for a strong body slam. Back out. We can just kill him with that body slam. Good stuff. I don't want any of that. Alright, well, we were not... Okay, well, we're pretty good against this fight, though. As again, the big thing is the wounds and a Evolves make the wounds not a big deal. Flame barrier. I definitely want to play the cleave though. I think we gotta go for the bash and bash cleave defend is crappy. Oh, we can always lock motion. Right, well, let's let's just commit here. Yeah, we'll just drink that lock potion. <coughs> the wounds are almost meaningless. Well, I guess we haven't played our evolve yet. Right, no reason not to drop kick him. slam to finish him properly. No. Ah, can't can't quite kill that. 
Let's see, are we full blocking anyway? 6, 12, 19. Okay, we're full blocking anyway, so we'll actually just not even worry about finishing him. Feed that, but uh, we're going to need to evolve, otherwise we may draw nothing. But uh, no reason not to war cry. If I put the wound up. I, I think it'll just come back. Good by the idea because we want to true grip the wound. Okay, yeah. Ah, got two. Uh, oh! Hmm. We get more block out. Okay, we get more block out of the flame barrier. It's a shame we can't just kill that, but it'll kill itself off at least. Well, this fight went pretty well. I think we'll be prepared to take on the boss. Don't need to bother with demon form. Now, the wounds can be pretty scary, but Evolve makes them just a new point. Alright. Not too bad off coming into the boss here. Uh, none of that's any good. Is there anything I need to upgrade, or maybe I should just take the rest? What do we get from that? Ooh, whole enemies, that's tempting. Three damage is not big enough for that. That's pointless to upgrade. Uh, I, I think this is the... Yeah, let's, let's just... Yeah, we'll, we'll upgrade the trip. Just because, thanks to Champion Belt, that's just a pretty good deal. Yeah, okay, I was pretty sure it was him. War cry. I'll toss that on top. Oh no, I should have tossed the trip on top. Well, I may end up safe scumming this fight, but. Hold on. Yeah, no, I'm just gonna. I need to safe scum that because I'm gonna need that trip next turn big time. I don't think we can afford to put off using the feed. Yeah. Trips. Pretty important this turn. Mm. Yeah, I think we do need to go for the demon form. Means we end up taking a little bit of damage. That's going to be worth it in the long run for sure. At least we're going to get some good clay value. Come on, cleave. Perfect timing. Drop <clears throat> kick that, finish it off. I don't think we get any statuses, so I think. Killing that off is the best deal. True grid away this evolve since 
don't think he applies statuses. <clears throat> on trip. Ah, no trip. That's alright. Leave and get more value. Yeah, we're better off. Okay, so flame barrier, strike, body slam. That's the way to do it. <clears throat> Super rude debuff. Alright, trip first. Uh, no reason not to drop kick. Bash, and we'll true grid away one of the crappy blocks. That was going pretty well. Shame we don't have a trip for this turn, but hey, at least we get cleave. I right, may as well drop kick him. Uh, good cleave. Block, block, block. And hey, we even get to kill one of them. Good stuff. Yeah, we're frequently maxing out our choker, but that's okay. Oh, trip is very nice. We need the. Okay, he's already weakened. So the bash isn't a high priority this turn. But okay, now we can finish that off with the bash. That'll be worthwhile. <clears throat> Our health is getting dangerously low though. Well, bash, I think. We're getting enough demon form value that will finish him off before his next big. Okay, yeah, we've just got so much demon form value. Well, none of this is really any good. Yeah, that went pretty well. Hmm. Cursed keys, tempting. Okay. Mm. Coffee dripper's too risky. Uh, busted crown's very tempting though, because we're not really looking for anything in particular at this point. In fact, we're really just wanting to slim down our deck some more. Uh, I mean, things we'd want to see still are some better block options. And Cursed Key is pretty solid though. Especially since we'll probably be able to hit a shop and or we have true grit. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll take the Cursed Key. Okay, we do not want to fight elites at all. We can avoid it. Looks like there is... There is no safe path. That is unfortunate. So, if there is no safe path, we just need to find the best path. So, let's see. This one's... This gets us a shop. Uh, couple camp, two shops, couple campfires. Yeah, let's just go for. Let's see, two events, two campfires, or. Two. 
two events. Ah, well, no, it's two campfires either way. It's only two fights over here. All right, so yeah, this path. All right. I don't think he plays any status. Well, we may just play the evolve, anyways. Yeah, I guess we'll just play the evolve, anyways. No reason not to just get it out of our deck. Hopefully, we can feed him. <coughs> oh, he does apply statuses. Well, what do you know? and true grid away the crappy block. We played the evolve, so the burns are almost meaningless. Uh, no reason not to drop kick. Uh, burn away. So we're going to want to bash just to get the weak. Or well, can we just kill him? Just short. Okay, yeah, we, we can just kill him with the feed. Good stuff. And if I went well, man, we're going to have a lot of health at the end of this here. Mmm. Old letting is tempting. Now, uh, we, we have five mana, and we have a copy, uh, a choker, so, yeah, we, we do not need bloodletting. <coughs> Always an obnoxious fight, but hey, we've got the cleaves, and the, ooh, trick cleave. Very nice. Careful. Spread my damn shout a bit here. <clears throat> One point of damage isn't too bad. Get some self performing clay out of it. Alright, no reason not to drop kick. Barrier, no reason not to. Uh, let's get rid of that defend. <coughs> yeah, going pretty well here. So we can feed. Feed. Lock. We're pretty likely to draw a cleave. Demon forms moot point. Yeah, we'll just do that and make sure we don't draw it into the evolve. Uh-oh, hope I didn't mess this up. I may have, but that's all right. Oh, yep. Definitely, I did not draw so great. Just going to true grid away that demon farm. It's way too late to even try to use it. Now well, that guy's coming back on me.
think I draw the cleave this turn. <coughs> okay, still no cleave. Alright, well, no reason not to drop kick. Very little reason not to bash. Lane barrier. Uh, okay, that that one goes. So he'll he'll off himself, and definitely get to cleave this turn. But those blocks could still do us in, unfortunately. Oh, it was not drawing as many attacks as we were hoping for. If he regrows this turn, it's going to be sad. And I think he is going to. But it's, it's okay. I mean... <laughs> okay, no. Alright, good. Good stuff. I wasn't sure if he was going to regrow this turn or not, because he died on his turn. can't really afford the war cry because of our choker <clears throat> and we don't want an unupgraded pommel strike. If it was upgraded I would have probably taken it. But yeah we can totally take an act one boss though. Lots of ghouls is but those curses are rough. <clears throat> Not to play, just get it out of our deck. Oh, he's one point off from switching forms, which is actually perfect. <coughs> uh, let's see, I want to get the maximum I can. Trip and we can drop it because we'll toss the cleave on top. We'll trip, that way we get the draw out of this drop kick. And now we'll have a perfect bash. Oh uh, yeah. Oh wait no, the cleave is better than the bash, isn't it? The cleave will do slightly more damage, and then we can bash after he changes forms. Uh, we're going to try to use the feed. <laughs> well, Demon form is going to be worthwhile. And we'll true grit the bad block. Good. True grit. Actually, we won't. Well, well let's play the drop kick first, then make a decision. Mm. Yeah, I'll true grit the bad block. Still. Holding out on our feed. <clears throat> uh, reason not to trip. Dang. Did that slightly backwards, but that's alright. Transform them again. Small-ish deck plus True Grit makes speed pretty reliable. Well, no reason not to trip. Uh, on barrier just cuz. Uh, cleave. Uh, okay. 
and we'll almost actually we'll 100% draw our feed with dropkick. It's just a matter of is dropkick going to kill him? Which it might. <laughs> I don't want to do that. Yeah, dropkick will probably kill him. Of course, we didn't draw the feed. All right, well, we can just stall for a turn and feed kill next. <clears throat> We're going to heal off of this fight rather than... Yeah, we took no damage at all. We're going to heal the full... Another body slam is tempting, but I don't think we can afford it with our choker. We don't have, we really don't have that much block. or more of a demon form build, and uh, it's tempting. And we definitely can't afford the flex. Uh, don't have any powers that we really want to be duplicating. Like metalize is the power you. That's worth duplicating. The demon form, it just costs too much. One tends to be enough. Yeah, we're shame to pass on the body slam, but because of our choker, we really it's not gonna be worth it. We don't have enough block. Uh, and flame may be worthwhile. Oh, well, now we're gonna remove a card. Uh, let's see, how many attacks do we actually have here? We've got Cleave, Bash, I'm just trying to decide whether I want to get rid of my last strike or not. One, two, yeah, no, I think we'll drop one of our crappy blocks. And flames, good, good enough to be worth it. Uh, no. Mm. Well, insect might be worth it. Do we get a second shop? Yeah, we do get an. We do get a second shop. So, we're not going to have any gold left over if we buy one of these. Yeah, we'll call that good, and we'll wait for the last shop there. <clears throat> Alright, well, we're just going to save scum this. Okay, well, we got a good one anyways. Do we still need to upgrade anything? Uh... Seems worth it. Warcry is still tempting, but we just keep not getting around to it. <coughs> Alright, demon form. Uh, flame or bash? Nah, gotta go for bash. not to trip, no reason not to drop kick. I don't think we're going to care about ball. I don't think he... So. Uh, okay, I can't play the work right this turn, otherwise I'm going to overdo my choker. Kitty, so grumpy. Such a grumpy kitty. Well, I think we're going to true grit this basic strike. Yeah, we'll do that. I 
I really do want to hold off on the feed still. Three damage is nothing. No reason not to drop kick. Uh, sure, we'll. Well, maybe not. Running into some choker problems. That's my last card. It's a demand. Okay, I want that demand. And and oh, can't body slam and bash. Dang it. No, that's okay. We'll just go for the bash. We'll get the weak off, which means we'll take no damage. And now we're just hoping to find the feed. Come on, feed. <coughs> well, I guess we're just going to stall. Let's gonna do this right with the feed. Although, am I going to take... How much damage am I going to take? Yeah, I'm going to take 28... Nah, it's not worth taking the damage to wait for the feed. Don't want any of that. Hey, we may finally upgrade this war cry. Although, yeah, no, I'm gonna upgrade the tang war cry. <coughs> Alright, so if I take the chest, I am going to get cursed, but we can save scum it. Two attacks. Do I even have two attacks to upgrade? I do. Drop kick and strike getting upgraded are worth it. Alright. And then we can remove the writhe at the next shop. Easier, a grump cat. <laughs> Silly kitty. All right, so eighteen, so Come sixteen. On. All right, we are going to need both of these. Two, four, two, three. Four, five. All right, so that's the plan. So we'll have drop kick ready to go for next turn. Oh wait. Well, hopefully I didn't screw this up, and I don't want to get cursed again. All right, now we're fine. Uh, well, now we don't need to defend. We can just get the evolve out of the way here. No reason not to drop kick. Uh, well, hopefully, that one's in flame. Hopefully, it will change into something disagreeable. Well, that's even more disagreeable. All right, let's try this again. Hey, that's <coughs> acceptable. Mm, not going to body slam. Too risky. Don't want to switch him into a curse. On a trip for sure. Alright, well, let's just use the feed just to switch them out of there. Not getting cursed, that's what really mattered. Uh, yeah, sure, well. Eat a little bit of damage this turn, but not too bad. Okay, that's what we don't want to see. That is the worst little thing. Alright. 
So, uh, start with drop kicks. There's no reason not to. Ugh, that's gonna hurt. Okay, we can true grit out this writhe. That's gonna hurt a lot. <laughs> Still better than getting cursed. There it goes, trying to do it again. Right, well, let's start with the cleave. Oh, that's just, that's going to be better. Alright, good stuff. I uh, don't want any of that. Alright, time for this elite. This is going to be rough. Oh no, it's this guy. That's, that is the scariest elite in the game. Uh, Alright, well. Flame. Uh, minions, so feed doesn't even work. Maybe I should have just attacked the rep to himself, but oh well. Oh, stop being grumpy, cat. Rocket, shoot. You came in here to yell at him. That's not fair. Alright, trip for sure. Uh, we'll cry. We're yeah, probably going to need that evolve. Lane barrier evolved. And, uh, okay, maxed out our choker. All right, the wounds won't matter thanks to our evolve. Definitely hurts. Okay, so leave. Walk. Uh, okay, we'll get the hear that demon form. It's still gonna hurt a bit, but it'll be all right. Bash. Drop kick. Leave. And it's gonna hurt, but it won't be all right. Moons don't matter, although they are something handy to true grit. Lost half our health, but that's okay. We'll have a rest point, and with how much health we've gotten off of that feed, we're running around with more max health than I often have. And we'll now just finish that off. There we go. Uh, I don't want. Well, limit breaks tempting, but too slow. Well. It is actually pretty, can be pretty good. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll take the limit break. We're a demon form build. Okay, well, we know for sure we're going to get rid of this ride. No doubt. Uh, Don't have another shop. Oh wait, no, we do have another shop. This was a surprise shop. 
Okay, so we will save our gold. <coughs> Get a nice feed off. Oh, is it worth limit breaking for one? Not really. But, eh, that's no, fine. If I regret it, I'll save scum. <clears throat> Four cry, no little reason not to. Okay, two form. Uh, it on top. Form. Name barrier. Oh, Solid. Don't think he applies any statuses, so let's go ahead and drop that evolve. Claim that just because we can. Alright, trip for good measure. Bash because we can. Flame barrier is a given. And true grit, the bad defend. I guess it was unnecessary to true grit, but I like trimming down my deck. Drop kick, no reason not to. Uh, trip. And just defend. Can I just kill him this turn? Let's see. Yeah, I think we can just kill him. Oh, no crap. I missed my feed. That worth saves coming for four health. <sighs> no. I'm not I'm not saves coming for four health. I lose the game by four health, I'm gonna cry. Okay, and flame's probably worth it. <clears throat> yeah, I'll take the take the inflame. Let's see here. Oh, I should have used my blood potion too. I should have used my blood potion before the fight ended, so, but that's all right. I think the rest is way more important than upgrading any of that. Yeah, it is. But we're in pretty good shape. Don't need any of that. All right, I think we'll get through this one without too much trouble. that per turn we're going to be doing more than one attack. <clears throat> I think we do want to hold off on the limit break yet. 
Well, maybe not. Don't have anything else to do this turn. Yeah, may as well. Uh, perhaps I shouldn't have, just because I needed to time his time warp a little bit better, but oh well. I think we're not going to have a problem getting through this regardless. that we only get to play three cards this turn Trying to save feed is pointless. Just sort of reckless offense at this point. Okay, well, we grit the bad defend. Ah, oh, crap! I chokered myself before I could body slam. Whoops. That's all right. This isn't Ascension 20. It's not going to be a big deal. I'll screw myself with that clock for next turn. He's likely just dead next turn regardless, as long as I... Oh yeah, I've got a couple good attacks coming. Oh, I should have used the steroid potion with that double strength card. That's alright. Okay, so... Yeah. Okay, three attacks. Oh wait, no, he did a big heal. That's that's okay. We're just not gonna worry about it. Now, this isn't Ascension Twenty, so I can just be a little reckless, no problem. There we go. All right. Well, Ascension. What was this? Eight. Ascension eight down. Alright, well, thanks for coming by, the, like, three people that did. <laughs> uh, it's quiet in the chat, but that's alright. Well, I will catch you next time.